Hi, I'm Aubrey Harris. I am the coordinator for Amnesty International's Canadian Section English Speaking Branch for the campaign to abolish the death penalty. Amnesty International opposes the death penalty on the grounds that it's a violation of the right to life. It is also a violation of the right to be free from cruel and inhumane treatment or punishment. These two rights are laid out very clearly as Articles 3 and 5 of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. This declaration was agreed to and supported by every country at the United Nations level in 1948. The death penalty is not a deterrent. It doesn't deter crime. It's generally found in areas where there is actually a higher level of violent crime. It's not cost effective. It's cruel to the prisoner. It's cruel to the prisoner's family and it's cruel to those tasked with carrying out the execution. It is always inhumane. There's no surefire way to have a clean execution or a kind execution. Executions are botched no matter which method is used. And the student national calls on the world for a universal moratorium and executions with a view to complete abolition of the death penalty for all crimes. Those countries that retain the death penalty are called upon to comply with their international obligations under laws such as the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights and the Convention on the Rights of the Child. And the student national also calls on those countries that retain the death penalty to comply with guidelines such as those of the Economic and Social Committee of the United Nations who set out both safeguards for those facing the death penalty. We also call on the countries that retain the death penalty to make information on the death penalty public. It's important that we get information out there. We need to have an informed public before you can make an informed choice on the death penalty. Thank you.